What's the prize? Um, we'll work something out later. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what it sounds like. Hello once again, it is time for another edition of You in Two and on this episode I'm delighted to be joined by Carl Burke. Carl, thanks for joining us. How are you? Now the idea is you've got two minutes to answer as many questions about your own career as you possibly can. The current leaderboard is on screen now, top of that is Tom Scudamore and Joe Tizard, they both scored 13. Of the flat trainers, we've only done Richard Fahey so far, he scored nine. A dubious nine I hasten to add. It might have been eight. But, you know, we'll leave that to the judges. Two minutes starts when I've asked the first question. Are you ready, Carl? I'm ready. You look very confident, actually. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> OK, question number one. Which course did you saddle the most winners at last season? God, last season. I take back pass, what I said about pass, you being confident. <laughs> I've got better. Uh, it was 13, so um, Question number two, who's the sire of Lawrence? Uni. That's right. Question number three. How many different courses did the two-time Group 1 winning sprinter Quiet Reflection win at? How many different courses? How many different courses? Haydock, Hamilton, Ascot. You can give me a number. Three. Three? It is seven. Eight career wins in total. Oh, two were at Haydock. Question number four. Havana Gray claimed victory in Group 1 company in 2018. Which race was it in? Uh, flying five at the current. That's correct. Question number five. Lawrence won six Group 1 races, but how many of those wins came with PJ McDonald on board? Five. Four. 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 Oh. Question number six. In what year did Lord Shanakil win the Prix Jean Pratt? Nine. Two, uh, yeah, 2009. Nine. I felt very Yorkshire when I said that. Uh, question number seven. Which horse did you win the 2013 Dante Stakes at York with? Libertarian. That's right. Who was second to Libertarian on that day? Jim Boulder's Trading Leather. That's right. Question number nine. How many Group 1s did Lawrence win in her career? Six. That's right. Number ten. How much did you purchase Quiet Reflection for? 44,000. That's right. Number eleven. You rode your first winner for Alan Jarvis at Hamilton. What was the horse called? The Britisher. That's right. Question number twelve. Which horse gave you your first winner as a jockey over the jumps? Um, Bloemfontein at Newton. That's right. Uh, in what year did Daring Destiny win the Air Gold Cup for you? Uh, 94. That's right. Which horse gave you your first winner as a trainer? Um, Temporarily. That's right. Which horse gave you your first Royal Ascot winner? Um, Quiet Reflection. Quiet Reflection, that's it. And that is time. Matt, can you talk the scores for me? Uh-oh. 12. 12? 12? 12, we'll go with 12. If it's wrong, there'll be a message on screen now, but 12 is pretty good going. I messed up on two or three, didn't I? know, you, you, could, <laughs> you could have, have done better, actually. You I don't know why better. I got the PJ McDonald one. I should have got that. So the leaderboard, including Carl, is now on screen, but with a very respectable score of 12, he tops the flat trainers table, uh, and you're going to, you know, second, third place on the, on the table overall, so that's pretty good going. Well done. What's the prize? Um, we'll work something out later. <laughs> 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 That's not what it sounds like. Um, for more videos like this, make sure you click the subscribe button down here and watch other videos up here. <laughs>